Okay, so I finished my other one and my other diamond painter. Now, yeah. So today, I want to physio. Wow, how did, why did I start off like that? Uh. <laughs> so I went to physio and it was good. Uh, squats are great, he said. Um, anybody can do squats. <laughs> it's pretty easy. Um, he showed me some new things. Um, I was going to physio beforehand, oh, beforehand, and um, what happened? Um, yeah, just you know, some things to do um, to help get like, cause how do you like my nerve, my my, because multiple sclerosis affects your stem cells, your nerves, and stuff like that. So my nerves are already shot as it is. And, um, so basically it's just to, like, wake up some of the nerves and be like, hello, you gotta work here, you gotta help out. Because I am weaker on one side than the other. Um, and then we talked about, like, all kinds of things and... And I told him my experience at the gym. I said I was going to a gym. I got turned off by, in order to, I asked one question. I asked one question and I get told, you need to hire a personal trainer if, if you wanna know that. I'm like, seriously? I, I just asked you which, like one thing, literally one thing. I just wanna know one thing. And you're telling me, just to show me that one thing, I have to hire a personal trainer. No, thank you. Um, and I think it was like perfect timing too. I ended up relapsing for a very long time. I went and canceled my, my, my gym membership. I went in and I said, it's medical reasons. I'm obviously, I can't do it because, you know, and I wasn't gonna, it was kind of like perfect because they even shut down they did so he's and <laughs> his name is Alex my uh, my physio and he goes they what they said what to you if it's just for one thing so you don't get hurt or hurt yourself what does it take to answer that one question and say okay you can do this and it's just it was just to make sure that I was gonna do it right and that I wouldn't hurt myself and um, from that moment on no gym for me I'm sorry my fat ass will do it at home thank you very much um, yeah and I was even telling him like I never used to be like this and I know my MS got worse and I like it's like I I have no strength like I I, I could lift a hundred and something pounds now <laughs> I can't even tell you now I can still I can lift and I was really strong with my legs too I could do up to 400 pounds with my legs my legs were very strong and I was making sure you know I was getting my back and everything now I don't know now I don't even know how much I can lift or do with my legs so he showed me some new things and which is amazing and I'm like okay he's like you don't need to go and buy an expensive ball. Um, it was one where I would put it between my knees and squeeze and do a bridge, like lift my butt off the, the bed or whatever. And uh, he's like, call the dollar store. Get a ball that it's not so hard that you can squeeze a bit. He goes, because I want you to do this and I want, you know, I'm like, okay. He goes, don't go spend $20 on a ball just go to the dollar store. I'm like, oh yeah, I'm not going to go spend that money. And then, uh, yeah, he's like, I'm so sorry you went through that. I'm like, it was just stupid. Like people, he goes, that's why they're out of business. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, yeah, that's pretty sad. I mean, it's sad that they went out of business, but it is sad that you have to tell somebody to get a personal trainer just for one little thing. One thing, like he goes, people are there everyone's there for a reason and they're trying to be, everyone's trying to better themselves or whichever way possible like whichever way they need you know and that's the last thing we want is to you know 
I was just like, yeah, but you know, it is what it is, you know, whatever. I don't know. Makes you wonder, right? But enough about that. Just makes you think, doesn't it? Like how, how people can be and how stupid, like, I don't know, like how a company can be and whatever. Well, I started a new diamond painting. It's it's a dragonfly on a um, lily pad or something. Yeah, a lily pad. So my other one's done. I did them. So a friend asked me if I sell mine, which I do sell my diamond paintings if you're willing to pay the price. <laughs> so yeah. Um, the last one I did was a custom and they paid me close to $400 and I wasn't expecting that much. I timed my hours. I told them what size they told me the size actually. And I told them, okay, this is how much it's going to cost. And if you want it framed without a frame, it's going to cost, you know? So I pretty, I basically got paid for my labor, which was great. Um, what else? That's it. So now I'm doing that. This one's a small one. It's just to you know, do whatever. Um, I did buy two. More of a like a happy birthday to me. Because my birthday's coming up in two weeks. So, well, two and a half. Two and a half weeks. So, yeah. Pretty excited. <laughs> so that's just a little birthday gift for myself. Happy birthday. Jimmy. Happy birthday to me. Anyways, yeah. So that's it, guys. I have nothing else to say right now. I'm just like so itchy right there. I'm going to get red now. I'm so itchy. But that's it, my friends. That's it. That's all for now. And um, I hope you guys have a good one. I look ugly. I look ugly today. I, this is how I went out. I put my hair up in a bun and I just went out like well this wasn't sticking up that's because I was playing with Isaiah I put it up and uh I didn't care I was like I don't care I don't care right now what I look like I'm gonna just go out oh I got paint on me I just noticed that <laughs> with the kids and this hand has marker on it somewhere or no it probably washed off yeah it washed off Okay, guys, I hope you have a great week. Peace out.